Hello everybody, in this video I want to introduce you to Design AI. This used to be called Styler before. It is an all-in-one AI design platform which has several features to cover all your design needs. To get started, you can just click start for free and continue with your Google account. Or if you have a business, you can sign up with your work email as well. Once you're inside, you're greeted with all the AI tools it has to offer, such as image to image, text to image, local edits, insert objects, and several others. You can also see the tools grouped in categories such as game development, portrait photography, jewelry design, interior decoration, product design, print on demand, and image restoration. In this video, I'm going to get started with one of the tools anybody can use, and that is text to image. Here you can provide a text prompt of anything that you have in mind and have AI generate an image. Here you'll see there's a prompt already populated. It's about a transparent perfume bottle. You can change the aspect ratio the way you want, select some advanced features where you can provide some negative prompts. The aspect ratio section actually mentions the social media platforms that you can select right away so you don't have to think about the different dimensions. I'm gonna keep the prompt the way it is and click generate. It's going to take a few seconds to generate the AI images. And once they're ready, you can just hover over them to preview what you generated. You don't even need to click on it. And I really like that. Now there we used a style called Flux, but you can choose from a bunch of different styles such as illustration, portrait, 3D, anime, line art, and logo design. Just spend some time finding the style you really like. Now, while it's a lot of fun generating images from prompts, my favorite feature of Design AI is the image to video. And I'm gonna show you three different examples of video generation using design. So make sure to stick around till the end of this video. Now, the image to video feature allows you to select any image, set some parameters, and generate a video. For this example, I'm going to start with an image that I had generated in one of my previous videos of a female alchemist working in a lab. So I'm going to start with uploading that image to my image to video feature of Design AI and then provide a small prompt on what you want to happen with this image in a video format. So I'm going to say I want a large explosion to happen in this lab that is featured in this image. Then you can set the imagination level. I'm going to set it all the way to the max. And then I'm going to set the duration. I can select 5 or 10. I'm going to select 10 and click generate. After about 5 or 10 minutes, my video is ready. So I'm going to click download on this video and view it next to the image so you can get an idea of what it generated. I'm going to name the video as large explosion that I added as a prompt. And just to remind you, this is the image I started with, and this is what I got. Wow. So I have a 10 second video of a massive explosion happening in this lab, and it also kind of expanded the whole view of the image. So you see how this is just about that much. And when I get the video, the lab seems to be expanding and it's adding more and more details like the table the full table didn't exist before and along with adding the big explosion it has added quite a bit more information all right now i'm going to try a new image and this time i'm not going to have a lot of distractions in the background so i'm going to have a single character and the character i've selected is a cute white kitten with a black background and i'm going to add the prompt as this kitten is just trying to yawn or like a cute yawning kitten with a black background. I'm going to keep my duration as 10 seconds and still keep the imagination all the way to the max and click generate. And after well over 15 minutes, my video is ready. Let's take a look at this cat. Wow, that came out more intense than I had planned. I was expecting something more cute, but we have this cat showing teeth, almost yawning aggressively. Let's look at it again. So since I set the imagination all the way to the max, we have this cat with some shadows and some very detailed teeth that I can see on this video. And I'm pretty impressed by that actually. 
All right, for the last video generation, I'm going to try an image with multiple characters and see how design handles it. So instead of one kitten, I'm going to have a litter of kittens. We have five different cute kittens, and this time I'm going to change the parameters a little bit. I'm going to set the imagination to be somewhere in the middle, set the duration as 5 seconds instead of 10, and set my prompt as kittens playing and click generate. Now each of these generations are taking over 10 minutes to generate. So we started with this cute picture of kittens and this is what we got. Wow, this came out very nice actually. I don't see too many flaws. Let's look at it again. We started with this and we have five kittens. One also seems to walk across in the back. Now overall, I'm very impressed with Design's image to video feature. Now remember, this is AI, so you do need to make a few attempts before you get the video right. So all you need to do is to sign up with one of Design's plans to access all the tools it has to offer. You can start with a free plan and then upgrade to a standard or professional plan. If you change from a monthly to an annual plan, you get a 20% discount, which I think is great. But I hope you got some value from this video. I would like to thank Design for sponsoring it. And if if you like hands-on product walkthroughs like these, make sure to subscribe to this channel. I have a lot more coming up. Till the next one, thank you so much.